The African buffalo, also known as Cape buffalo, not to be confused with water buffalo as they occur in Asia. Often revered as one of the most dangerous animals in Africa, the buffalo is actually a very intelligent and sociable animal with a very complex herding and behavioral structure. Buffaloes are bulk grazers, mainly feeding on grass. However, when the drier seasons arrive and fresh, palatable grass becomes scarce, they can be seen browsing on leaves in woodland habitats. Buffaloes are diurnal, even though they can be seen to do a lot of their feeding at night. This is due to the cooler temperatures at night, as during the hotter hours of the day, they prefer to rest and use this time to ruminate. The birds you can see sitting on a buffalo are called red-billed oxpeckers. They have a symbiotic relationship with the Cape buffalo and remove ticks and other parasites from the skin and hair. The oxpeckers diet consists mainly of ticks, but also includes other parasites such as blood-sucking flies, fleas and lice. Given the opportunity, adult oxpeckers will consume hundreds of ticks and thousands of larvae in one day. Even though these beautiful birds help to clean the buffalo, they can often be detrimental and hinder the healing process as they will keep old wounds open in order to drink the blood. When on safari, you may notice what seems to resemble scabbing on the side and back of buffaloes. These lesions are caused by parasites known as Parafilaria bisoni. Mating occurs between March and May. The buffalo cow's gestation period is around 330 days. Single calves are born between January and April with a distinct peak in February. They are strongly gregarious mammals. Some herds recorded up to several hundred and often observed into the thousands. These herds may fragment into smaller herds. They are extremely sociable, but as you can see, the adult bull buffaloes fight for different reasons. It could be for play, dominance interactions, and actual fighting. A real fight can be seen when a bull approaches another, lowering with his horns down and waits for other bulls to do the same thing. When sparring, the bull twists their horns from side to side. If the sparring is for play, the bull may rub his opponent's face and body during the sparring session. Actual fights are violent and rare and very brief. Time to test your knowledge. What is the most common nickname for a buffalo bull? Answer our poll in the top right hand corner. Buffalo calves may also spar in play, but adult females rarely fight as there is no need for a dominance display. Buffalo have been known to kill lions, sometimes chasing them up trees and keeping them there for hours on end. There is a famous video known as the Battle of Kruger where a buffalo calf survived an attack by both lions and a crocodile after the herd intervened. A buffalo herd really brings the term safety in numbers to life with hundreds of eyes and hundreds of years on high alert at all times.